We've been seeing kind of versions of augmented reality for quite a while with live sports. We see things like the virtual first down line, we see replays with ghosts of players running around on the field and such. I'm Mary Beth Gandy. I'm a principal research scientist at Georgia Tech. I'm also the director of the Wearable Computing Center and I do uh, augmented and virtual reality research. I'm Blair McIntyre. I'm a professor in the School of Interactive Computing and director of the Augmented Environments Lab. The way you define augmented reality is that you are placing virtual content in the physical world um, and trying to make it look and feel like it belongs there and that uh, the experience is interactive. AR is really still in its infancy. Tantalizing, but had not really taken off. So I think it's going to take sort of two parallel things. It has to be easier to create these experiences and add them to existing content. So I think one of the big things with the kind of research we do is not thinking about augmented reality just as a technology, but thinking as a way to achieve a certain end. Nothing really interesting is going to happen until a lot of different people in different domains can start leveraging this medium. We've got some technology challenges that we have to overcome first. Because right now, the experience has to be kind of significant in order for you to purchase this equipment and put it on and set it up. Recently, the technologies for doing virtual reality on the web, these have been maturing at a rapid rate. It really seemed to be a good time to start working with companies to create a similar set of technologies for augmented reality on the web uh, based on all this work that we've been doing. So I, I've taken a leave and I'm working at Mozilla to try to actually make augmented reality a thing that's in web browsers that allows anybody to create and uh, distribute AR experiences. It's pretty obvious to me that at some point in the future, our digital information will be more tightly integrated with our world. And that's all augmented reality is. 